Datusri Awante is an entrepreneur with businesses around the world. His company FusionX specializes in analytics and big data. The company, which is listed on the London Stock Exchange, also hires Malaysians abroad. A World Bank report from 2011 said that there were as many as a million Malaysians overseas. The appointment of Ang Keng Hui as AIA's global head reminds us that there are many talented Malaysians out there. There are many who have made it overseas and their names are familiar to us. There are lots more who are successful but are largely anonymous. They are in every field imaginable, but a growing number have made their mark as entrepreneurs in recent years. This is their story. No, I like Malaysia a lot, yeah. Because I, I live more than half my life outside Malaysia. I went to Hong Kong for the money. I, I had, can't speak uh, Cantonese, can't read Chinese, you know. So I had no incentive to go there. I had every incentive to stay here. But there was no career opportunity. Well, I had the um, privilege and the opportunity to start my career in the United States, in, in the UK. I've worked in countries such as Hong Kong, Singapore, Malaysia, Thailand. So I've really had the, the, the opportunity to see lots of different things in every part of the world. Um, the grass that is well watered, that is well fertilized, and the grass that is well taken care of, regardless of which side of the fence it is, is, is the grass that's going to be green. And I've seen lots of grass from all over the world, but I truly believe that if we take care of the grass, that grass is going to be green. Jiaheng and Adelante are property developers in Australia. They studied in Melbourne and initially planned to return after getting some experience. But an opportunity came around and they decided to stay on. For us, it's sort of a natural transition. We found an opportunity there because just we, we studied there and an opportunity popped out. Um, but many of our friends that we know as well, our peers have found great opportunities here as well. Um, just because of timing and you know really it's about timing and opportunities just sometimes come out in front of you which you can't control and uh, it's a sort of a natural transition for us. More than half of Malaysians who are residing overseas are in Singapore. Most are not well known as Jimmy Choo, Michelle Yeo or Yuna. Opportunities are what most Malaysians are looking for and these are what those we spoke to talked most about. So I think Malaysia somehow we had to create a wonderful uh, and rich career opportunities for the young generation that will make them want to stay and believe in uh, what we call an expanding future. Not a static future, but an expanding future. Imagine somebody going abroad and, and studying abroad and he sees the kind of culture, he sees the kind of workplace and he works for a couple of years in, in the States or in Silicon Valley or he works for a couple of years in, in Europe. And then he comes back and he sees a very, um, how would I say, a little bit of an old-fashioned way of doing things in some parts of uh, the world. And then this person might not be very attracted to come back because he thinks that all the, place, all the workplaces are, are similar. It's really, uh, we don't really have a plan <laughs> at the moment, like where we want to, but I think Malaysia is still home. Australia is home as well because we've spent a lot of time there. So um, really depends on the opportunity and you know when things feel right. It's a season, season as well. Could be we back for you know six months and then because there's a need here. Yeah. I think Malaysia actually is uh, one of the best talent pools I ever come across. We actually have a uh, long history of hiring people from uh, Malaysia, partly because. We find that the talent and brains here are available at a very reasonable price. Yeah. And most of the talent we have in Malaysia, they are reasonably hungry, willing to sacrifice. Yeah. I think that um, there are a lot of great Malaysians out there. There's a lot of great talents. You know, one of the top <clears throat> you know, chefs or architects or landscape architects, a lot of them are actually Malaysians. and. Um, I feel like Malaysians are very um, daring. They, they go out, they, like what you said there, we are very global. Uh, we are all well-traveled. Uh, we're not so afraid to actually venture out and explore. I, I just wanted to say that I'm actually very proud to be Malaysian. I see a lot of uh, hope. I see a lot of promise in this country. I like the place. I like this is home. I, I enjoy working with the people. And I think there's immense and uh, an abundance of talent here in Malaysia. What I do say is that we need to work together now and we need to do something that's best for the nation, the community. You never really lose your strong emotional attachment to the place that you were born. 